Hello guys, today I want to explain one small feature in our live wire version of Quick Admin Panel. When we do wire model for the text fields or any input fields, we use wire model defer. What is defer and why it is used? So let's take a look at example. We have an article form and I've opened network tab so you would see all the network requests. And if we use wire model defer, we can fill in the form with something whatever and we save and there is no network request as you can see although livewire is kind of famous for doing a lot of server requests so wire model defer prevents from that and defer means that this model value will be saved only on submitting the form so we save there's one request there was one request then the page is refreshed and then you see the table but what happens if we remove wire model defer so we do just wire model to article title we refresh the page to have a new article and see request see another request i'm just typing anything and with any typing letter with any change there is a request live wire request to the server which makes some performance problems potentially it's not a huge request but if you care about performance a lot then wire model defer can help you now what happens if i type in something quickly there's also only one request. So Livewire makes a new network request waiting 150 milliseconds by default after any change. So as you can see, as I type a bit slower, if it's slower than 150 milliseconds, then there is a request to the server. Of course, you can customize even that. There is a parameter called debounce. So you can change wire model dot debounce dot, for example, 500 milliseconds or actually Let's put it a thousand milliseconds or one second. And let's see how it works. Actually, we refresh and then it waits for a second to make a request. So you can type in a bit more and then only have one request. So there is another way to improve the performance. But as I said in the very beginning, by default, we generate all the blades with wire model defer to protect you from any performance issues. So wire model defer you will find everywhere in the blade files, but these are a few ways how you can customize it. And it may be useful actually, if you remove defer, you can also create some live events like live validations. And I have an example of that to create the slug or to have live validation. And the link for that video is in the description below, or you can see that on the screen as well. So you can watch that example next and check out our quick admin panel generator at quickadminpanel.com.